Hello, mobsters, and welcome back to the Mobus Archives. This is your host, Mobus Rex, and we are playing Auction Not Included, and due to some stuff that we've done, Auction kind of isn't included. Um, one of the things I have noticed, whoops, is between recordings, is that our latrine is not a latrine. Uh, it's too big. 73 tiles instead of 64 tiles. We're just going to get this built up a little bit like that. And that should be enough to turn this into a better room, which should help get their morale up. Uh, Joshua is our apprentice miner, but he, his morale is a little too low, so we need to keep this stuff going. Now, everything here has no oxygen. So, or, that wasn't, that wasn't oxygen, that's oxygen. Uh, so this is kind of a critical area to fix up. And I think what we're going to do is or maybe not this one, but we're going to expand the area here um, just to give the chlorine somewhere to go. Uh, it's heavier than oxygen, so this should be the right way to do it. In fact, we can probably give it another axis vent so it goes down this way. Because uh, we do have see some chlorine here. Uh, we might get a lot of the carbon dioxide going this way there as well. We will have to check and see. Um, we might even want to reorient some of this stuff as it goes. Now, I'm wondering if we can give anybody else a job. Nama? Nope. Need to get that morale up still. Uh, we had... What the blocks? You have a growth? I didn't know you had a growth. Uh, we'll get another briar seed planted here. Oh, come on. And that should help decor a little bit. Uh, this room got completed, so it should give a morale bonus whenever they use it. I don't. I don't. Are you trapped? I'm just not doing anything. Uh, this might have been worse. Because uh, now we're losing... Well, we're losing the carbon dioxide. Uh, let's just dig this way. Get into there. Uh, we might even want to breach here. Uh, just to get into this room so we can get a little bit of that auction for ourselves. And it'll eventually just come out of its own accord. And, of course, probably float all the way up here. There's actually something to be said. Why don't we move our bedrooms up here? Just get our cots. And basically move all of our working stuff up here as well. And then we don't have to worry about too much about the chlorine and stuff down here. That's something that's viable. And Joshua is at 2 of 2 again. Nama's actually getting pretty good. Uh, I'm going to say she, go ahead and, she goes ahead and gets um, supply. That's going to give strength. And for Valdo, you might as well do supply as well. And see how far along that path we go. We're probably going to end up with a few super dupes. Uh, with everybody doing lots of different jobs. And with the repositioning of everything, I think I will move... I forgot to cancel that. Uh, but I think I will move the uh, research station... Yeah, this isn't really helping as far as um, chlorine goes. I'm actually concerned that we might have screwed ourselves with that. Yeah, basically our livable area is up here now. <laughs> so, deconstruct that. Uh, deconstruct you. Get our furniture moved up, water cooler. Could be in a high oxygen area. Up here. And we'll get stuff moved along. You're appreciated. Come on. Is that not take good dog? Yeah, there we go. And copy that cot. Here and here. At least we have oxygen now. Deconstruct those. Whoops. Got those. Leave the med bed out for now. Uh, it does need more research. 
Well, we just disassembled nearly everything. So, station. Research station. And power. Make this one a little bit nicer. Let's get some wiring going down into the floor. And we'll replace that with flooring. There we go. Uh, and we'll make that a bedroom again. And I think I have that lives close. Let's give this a priority six. Oh, no, they're doing it. There we go. So we have unused room here. The tree will be fine. You're blocked. Undug material. Undug material. What? Hmm. Alright, dig this stuff out. I'm going to put in some storage basins. Uh, cleaning up all the crap on the floor is also going to help. I'm going to restrict this. To slime. You can be swept. And I thought there was slime down here. Yep. Uh, sweep that slime. Uh, you guys, you can hold all but sweep only. And I'm going to do that, um, just sweep up here. That should help. Get all that swept. And that never got done. You can probably get uh, our auto high reset. Yep, that's fine. We have a couple extra rooms here, just because we moved nearly everything. Um, these guys are still producing oxygen. I don't know from what. There might be some carbon dioxide moving down here. But this chlorine has well chlorinated everything. That does get you dug out as well. All right, we're just working on getting our morale up. Ruby's up. So Ruby can now have a job of her own. Supply and farm. No one's a builder, huh? Operate. Yeah. Go ahead and be uh, a supplier. We'll get building once, uh, once we're ready. And, yeah, sweet. That all. Uh, we might even want, um, food. A couple more planter boxes. Because we are suffering from atmosphere problems. Um but we also have an extra dupe to feed as well. Uh, go ahead and get some research going. We have one move all the way to decontamination, but to do that, we need... There you go. Advanced research. Let's get that started. Uh, we've got a little bit of view on other stuff. I'm giving a quick look. We know we have chlorine. We have water. Do we have anything else here for us? For us. Not just yet. Alright. We will need to take care of our food situation. So we do have a few bristle blossoms that are growing, uh, but we are seeing some issues with polluted water. There's pollution exposure here, which isn't good. Um, it should be fine. It's in a sterile atmosphere. And they're all eating down here anyway. Yummy. Uh, we don't have any chefs or anything like that. Well, we do have a cook, but no cooking really we're doing. Uh, can we? No. Uh, no, food. Micro musher. Yeah. Ugh, it's something. I guess water can't be swept. I guess if we wanted to do that, we can be uh, plumbing, bottle emptier. Just do that. Alright, back to work. 
Maybe they should harvest that eventually. They're building the, uh... They did something. To build that. Hmm. Just getting these sweep orders done. Gotta be careful about what we put in here. Um, I'm gonna give you a six because apparently the dupes aren't doing what I'm expecting them to do. They're probably all just delivering stuff because that's what their job priority says to do. Yeah, this polluted auction is becoming somewhat of a problem. Uh, we'll be able to clean it up shortly. It at least has no infectious qualities right now. It's breathable is what I'm saying. Hey, ventilation. Bridges, pipes, pumps, and vents. Uh, we might eventually want to start pumping all the chlorine back down here. And maybe get the carbon dioxide out. Um, the chlorine would be more beneficial for this stuff. Uh, here we go. Empty water. And there we go. We're starting to get rid of some of the water all over the place. Here we go, micro musher on its way. And it looks like actually our auction is starting to normalize, which is good. Kind of what we want to see. Yeah, not duplicate, not idle duplicate, so. Two of two, three of two, Joshua's starting to get, uh, get a good morale. All right, uh, what are we researching? Pressure management, good. Keep it up. And we've got a couple of rooms that we can do. You could be expanded, I think. Um, what do we need for med bay? Med bay. Medical bed, toilet, mess table. Okay. So I'm going to say medicine, wash basin. Here. Plumbing, outhouse. Here. And that should be good enough for now. Uh, won't qualify as a med bay. It needs a mess table before it go before it works. Now we're looking for ways to boost their morale, just so that they can get better jobs. Um, they need two more. I think any of them need two more before before they can reasonably be assigned to a higher level position on this side. The we'll awesome seeds. Should be one more for here. Now we do have to feed these water, which is a thing, but at least they're getting light. And it's kind of a passive thing for us. Uh, power. Fire. Through there. I'm waiting for that pressure management so we can move this chlorine out. Actually, we need the filtering too, don't we? Ah, the necessities of life. Lice loaf. Um, if we can get enough meal lice going. And to do that, we can actually say, don't eat meal lice. So they collect it, they just won't do anything with it. Come uh, on, Nama, research. 17. Almost. Almost. And we'll have to watch this. We kind of don't want it to overflow. Uh, what are we doing? Copy the setting here and here. And research complete. Ah, pressure management. That's a manual airlock, which means I can toss this on its side. Uh, let's say deconstruct that. Oops. I have a cat on my lap, so I'm not as agile as I would like to be. Uh, job mastered. Great. So now that Joshua's mastered that job, we can put him on something else. I'm going to put him on build. 
then. That shouldn't increase his morale requirement. No, it stays at that same level as long as they're at that level. Um, do we have anything for him to build? Well, right there, I guess. Uh, but what we'll need to do, I think, is to get some power going. Manual generator. Battery. Um, and then we're going to have to get a gas vent. Bring out of this side. Gas pump on this side. We're going to start to move some of this stuff over. No ventilation. We're going to want to filter it, though. Uh, so that lets me know we need to get um, filtration going. So we're going to get, go through plumbing just to get that first. So this, at least, is preventing the rest of this area from being chlorinated. We can move, replace these walls with one of those as necessary. How's the heat? Not too bad, actually. I'm a little surprised. Uh, make you again sweep and sweep. If you wouldn't stand there, it kind of would help. Uh, you're taking. I guess this does have some oxygen as well. Uh, might as well harvest that. Oh, hey, auto harvest, or own harvest. We're trying to get life loaf, but not enough meal ice still. And do you store? Yeah, you should store meal ice. Uh, don't stay down there too long, Ruby. <laughs> and we are getting research. Yeah, research is happening. Right. And you actually are thinking stop. Nope, nope, stop. Uh, that's getting dangerously high. <laughs> Just a little too dangerously high. Let's start sweeping the bathroom. Get that, all that up. Oh, you. There's a lot of that debris. Just get it into these chambers and they'll be fine. Anything else we can do? Mess table for the halls, cafeterias, washrooms, latrines, massage clinic. We have that furniture. We do we could make a massage clinic? Like right here. Right, just replace that tile, and I'm going to say, since it's a de-stress room, replace it with granite tile. And then we can run that wire that should have been here. Hideously up through there. That's going to give a negative mood. Plumbing research is complete. Don't need plumbing. We need to deal with our atmosphere. Oh, that scheduled downtime. Why aren't you guys up going up here? I guess this is when you go to the bathroom. Run down here for food. Yeah, we're going to have to get some stuff sorted. Maybe... Actually, I think I'm going to re rework some wiring. Do we have a switch? We don't have a switch yet. Eventually, I'll rework some wiring. Uh, just to turn on and off the power for that. So it's not just going all the time when it starts going. Planning for the future. Hopefully not too distant future. Someone almost finished... almost finished lice loaf. You allowed to eat lice loaf yet? No, because we haven't made one. I'm gonna give you a six. <laughs> Want a little bit more of those a day. It actually makes these more valuable because they produce more, uh, produce more calories. Meal lice on its own. We have none. Right now, I think we're only harvesting bristleberries. Hey, food, guys! Food! Eat it! Looks 
like we just did. Back to a food shortage. But if they can, they will make life left. I'm actually going to say do it forever. Uh, at least for now. Uh, until there's something better. Because that's our primary food source uh, that won't give them diarrhea. Uh, if we make micro mush, it will give them diarrhea. Ah, you're very appreciated. I think I might have put this too high, too far. Uh, Ruby, you're not doing anything. I guess that's fine. The job's going. Not bad. We're actually going to get this area here swept up. Uh, mostly because I worry about uh, the hatch eating this stuff. They don't need to eat that. Of course, we might end with starving hatch. Which wouldn't be good, but it actually gives these guys something to do while uh, Joshua researches. And Joshua isn't a researcher. We don't have a specialized researcher. Jo Joshua is, and if you're hearing that, that's my cat. Uh, Joshua is a builder. We'll have to wait for someone to have a good enough morale. And Ruby's current is two. It's three and twos and stuff like that. We can get decorations going. I think that would help. Also cleaning up the place. And that's one of the reasons I'm sweeping. This will be very useful. Although I think eventually this clay is going to break. And this is going to drain out. But this is going to be hot. Yeah, which can be problematic. Three more! And we have filtration. Now that's kind of what I'm waiting for before trimming this all off. And getting this chlorine out down here. I'm actually thinking that maybe we don't need it anymore. But it would be nice to get rid of. We will pass up and down here a little bit, so once we do see that there is a problem, um, turn it on, we can get rid of it. Eventually we'll have a big, vast pipe network set clean this stuff up automatically? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Alright. Filtration research complete. They were telling me that. I wasn't listening. Uh, so we'll need the gas filter. So, input. Okay. This pipe, so output, input. We'll have one that tosses it back out, and one that tosses it down there. Uh, you are also going to need wire. Up into there, and ventilation here. You will be filtering chlorine and getting that out of the system. So we'll keep carbon dioxide, oxygen, polluted oxygen all up here. And I think next, we'll research artistic expression and get some of these decor items going. And that should help our morale. Ooh, actually, Nama. It's really good. You like operating, but I think I might want to put you on research next, Nama. Unless you can't do it at all. We'll see. Your job will be... Well, your job is pretty much because you have the best morale of us all. There's a tile. Any tile around the base, we kind of want to be granite just to make it prettier. If we can do it. And they're going to have to use the toilet, so we might as well put it there. Um, that's going to help some base decoration. And improve our morale slightly. Just want to get this morale game going. Soggy feet. What? Oh, there's some water on the floor there still. Oh, and these should just be left. We really don't need wash our hands going to the toilet. But leaving the toilet might be useful. All right. Well, this has been Movies Rex from Movies Archives. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, leave us a like. There's comments and suggestions. We'll be back with you soon. Have a good day and a wonderful night. Bye-bye.